Hey everybody, it's Indiana Outdoor Discoveries. Today, we got a couple catfish. This is a channel catfish. We're gonna show you how to fillet it, and we're gonna show you how to cook it. Okay, we're back. We got the fillets off. Now it's time to cut the meat off the skin. So what I do, I just hold it down with my fingernails, and I just start cutting down, getting all that meat, and I okay, just move so my- Okay, so catfish have really thin skin, so it's easy to cut the meat off the skin. I just pinch it down with my fingernail like this and cut down with the knife and I move my fingers up with the meat. So like wherever I'm cutting the meat off at, I just move my fingernails up with it to help hold it down because if not, it's not very stable. Now you can see, sometimes there'll be a little bit of meat left over on the skin, but it's okay. I mean, salvage as much as you can. There you go. Oh. Almost dropped it. Okay, so there you go. Nice catfish fillet. Now the skin you just dispose of. Now here's the second one. This one's a little bit mangled, so I'll try to get as much meat as I can. But this is a thick one, so cut that part off and finish that later. Okay. So what I do, I cut a little indentation where you can put your fingernails, and then you slide your knife right there. Start cutting down. Start cutting all the meat off there. Make sure you get under there like that. There you go, so it's off the skin. Now these are the fillets. We'll be back whenever it's time to cook. Got another channel cat. He's a nice one. This is the sixth one we've caught today, the sixth one that, we've, that we're gonna fillet. This will make for some nice meat. Tomorrow, you're gonna see how we're gonna prepare it. Stay we're tuned. back with another channel cat. Ashton caught this one. We're gonna fillet it. We'll be back when we got something else. All right, so we're back. It's the next day. We got our catfish fillets. This is the pile we made for nuggets. We're gonna fry these fillets whole. So we're gonna show you how to do it. Yeah. All right, so first you gotta pour some oil down on the pan. Not too much, just gotta cover it up a little bit. Next, you gotta get your breading. So today we're gonna be using Andy's fish breading. So we got the fillets all lined out. Now we have to put them in the breading and start rolling them around. There you go, that was good. Now that they're breaded, we're gonna let them fry for a couple minutes and then we're gonna turn them over. All right, so here's what your finished car should look like. Nice and crispy. Just let it fry and after a few minutes, turn it over and let the other side cook and then throw it down on a plate and put some paper towels on it to absorb the grease. And then after this row, after this whole plate gets filled up, put a new layer of paper towels down and then you can put more fillets on top of that. Thank you.